What is up there, YouTubes? It's Mr. Sergeant Cottonell here, playing some spy gameplay using the Diamondback, the uh, Spicicle, and the uh, Dead Ringer today. Uh, Diamondbacks. I'm just gonna give you a little uh, brief little weapon thing. It, it what it does is basically every time you sap a building, uh, you get a guaranteed crit, um, but it doesn't randomly crit. And I believe there's also like a firing speed thing with it. It doesn't shoot as fast as, say, the revolver. But, um, but yeah, that's that's how that works. So um, that's a lot of fun. Uh, that is that is like a ton of fun, actually, I got to admit. Using it, because as you can see here, bam, get another sentry uh, building down. And this medic's chasing me down. He thinks, he thinks he can find me. He can't find me. And look, I got two saved up crits. And I think I'm just going to go bang, bang, you're dead. Don't even try. Um... But guys, crazy news, uh, there was a twister slash tornado, I don't know what the big deal on the classifications is, but there was one, through my town, crazy, crazy, there hasn't, apparently a friend said that we haven't had, like, anything like that in, like, 50 years, so that's, you know, that's kind of, that's, that's significant, we haven't had one in that long, but of course, I'm going to blame him for saying that when the storm came in, because he said that as the storm was just coming in, so I'm going to blame him for that one, uh, but yeah, <laughs> just absolutely nuts um and why can i not shoot this sniper to save my life uh i don't think he kills me but like i think yeah i think that's just yeah that's just horrible and now i hit him just fine just there but that that's that's messed up but yeah guys so that's crazy um like i mean and the extent of the damage is kind of nuts like in my little subdivision area it's like nothing really it doesn't even look like there's a little bit of like there's a little bit there's like twigs and stuff but when you get like literally a block from my house there's like trees uprooted there's um like factory buildings missing like bits of their roof there's a loading dock like not that far from my house for a factory that has a like it's literally like just demolished like the brick the brickwork is just all caved in the roof is just collapsed it's um like there's one place that the fence is just all knocked down because uh, of the tree, there's a bunch of trees in the area, and they're just shredded. There's, like, nothing on top, pretty much. It was nuts. It's nuts to just see how devastating, I guess, something like that can be. But I was lucky I didn't get it too much. It wasn't my end of town, but it just didn't... I don't know why, it just kind of veered away from my subdivision area. So, I was lucky. My, my, uh, I was very lucky, to say the least. Um, um, and it was weird, because at first... I was very just ignorant to the fact that there was even really like that big of a storm. We were, me and my friend were even considering barbecuing if the wind wasn't so heavy because what it was is it was like, oh, there's the skies are really dark. Uh, what do you think? Uh, well, try to barbecue, and the wind kept knocking the flames out. So we were like, oh, whatever, we'll just go inside, and the power went out because there was actually the hydro pole got knocked down. Uh, down the road for me, so I was, I was out without power till around 12 o'clock last night, or I guess this morning, I guess if you want to say. Um, but it was crazy just looking around uh, when the after after the initial uh, after it initially went through, just driving around, seeing everybody like everybody's helping each other out, which is great. That's why I guess I kind of like small towns because when something when shit hits the fan, people do get together people do do, do do see who needs help people help out you know i saw people like at certain houses like some people have a big tree in their house there's other like their neighbors are going over with hacksaws to try and help them out you know help clear a little bit of it like yeah the biggest the big part of the tree is not going to go but at least you can you know get rid of the branches so that when the city workers come they can just haul the tree out and like grind the tr the big the big part of the tree up by itself i mean that certainly helps them out, and they can just, you know, throw all the twigs and stuff in the shredder, and it'll make the city worker's job easier. The cleanup, I think, for this is going to be nuts. Um, property damage alone is also going to be, like, for some places, like Sobeys, I heard the down from the, the Sobeys down from my house just had, like, the, the, the compressor, their, like, air conditioning compressor just ripped off the roof and, like, thrown back down on top of it. Um, I heard like a, I've heard a bunch of things to be honest. I've heard a bunch of different things happen and a lot There's just a lot of damage. Uh, the golf course road is just nuts And yeah, so my friend I'm still blaming my friend because why why would you say that when a big storm's coming and People think it might be a tornado. Why would you tempt fate by saying oh we haven't had one in such a long time Because you know what that is that's mother nature going. Oh, oh really? Oh, what what was that this kid this kid says I'm not gonna 
This kid says we haven't done that. Oh, well, you know what? I'm going to show this kid up, and boom! And it did. And we're going to blame him because we can. But yeah, guys, so that's nuts. So I guess now I can say I've been through a tornado, twister, whatever. I guess I think tornado is the smaller one. I think twister is the biggest one. I'm not sure. You'll probably tell me if I'm wrong. But um, yeah, guys, kind of crazy. Um, just... I don't know. I don't know what else to say. It's just I'm still kind of like really like that really happened. I'm very confused. But uh, the video is winding kind of down to a close here. Uh, as usual, uh, we win naturally. Oh, I get hit with a friggin' regular hit. I don't know. I think I felt like that was a crit hit that should have happened. But anyway, get top tier. That's always awesome. But anyway, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you enjoyed my rambling on about the Twister story. And other than that, guys, I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.